Haystack TV started in 2013 as a startup coming out of the Stanford Stardex Accelerator. We were frustrated with how news were getting out because every time we turned on the TV, we had to watch the same news as everybody else. Our elevator pitch here at Haystack TV is that we enable people to watch the news that they care about. One of the decisions we had to make at the beginning was what platform to start with. As a small startup, we needed a platform that would allow us to iterate quickly. We got that with Android. The team at Haystack TV really loves working with Android. The documentation is really clear and, and easy to use. It can be a lot of fun to program for Android. Our users wanted to watch the news in their living rooms, on their TVs and there wasn't a platform out there for them to do that. A lot of the smart TVs to date have been pretty proprietary, closed systems that have been hard for developers like us to access. With Android TV, we were able to finally open the door into the living room. Even though a developer can easily take their mobile app and throw it on Android TV, what works really well, we found, was to actually design an Android TV first experience. Developing for Android TV was super fast. We literally did it in two weeks. We've seen amazing results after integrating with Android TV and Chromecast. Originally, our mobile users were spending an average of 40 minutes per week watching the news. Now we've actually doubled that. Our growth trajectory is really strong right now. We've managed to grow at 40% month over month since we started, and a big part of that is the integration with the TVs. The new beta testing feature that, that Android released allowed us to reach our early beta and alpha testers and also allowed us to integrate with Google Plus so that we could reach different communities of early adopters. That was extremely powerful for us. A small startup like ours is now able to make a big impact with just six people reaching out to millions of users and a lot of it is thanks to the tools and platforms that we have with Google.